Good day, guys. Um, we'll be talking about Bregma and the clinical notes. And what to actually bust my head is if you are telling me that I don't even know what Bregma is, I almost, I almost, my head will almost scatter. Okay, so we'll be talking about the Bregma and the clinical notes on Bregma. In adults, this is just for you to know. In adults, Bregma is just okay. It's just a landmark on the score. Okay, so if they ask you to talk about the clinical notes, you have to check round Bregma, okay, including how Bregma is in children, okay, what develops into Bregma. That's where you get to see the clinical notes, all right? So without wasting time, babies, let's go on. Uh, this is where the Bregma is at. Bregma is uh, the meeting point between the coronal suture and the sagittal suture, you feel me? Uh, next is the, the parietal bone. Uh, you see the sagittal suture here. You see the parietal foramen. Uh, you see the lambdoid suture. You see the occipital bone. Uh, you see the lambda. You see the frontal bone. You see the coronal suture. All right. And this is the bregma uh, focus. All right. So now, bregma is the point of intersection between the coronal and the sagittal suture. In the fetal skull, it is a site of membranous gap called anterior fontanel. Okay, the anterior fontanel here is what get close by. How you get your bregma shape? Feel me? All right, let's go. Uh, this is the anterior fontanel. Uh, this is the bregma that we are talking about. This is the lambda. This is the posterior fontanel, and Let's keep talking about the Bregma. All right, I'm coming trying to send some things to my phone. Oh, it's okay. Two, two. Nice. The Bregma closes at about 18 months of life. That's like one year, six months. Okay, one year is 12 months or something like that. And now, in congenital disorder, the cleidocranial diastosis. That's uh. Okay, in, in the congenital uh, disorder, that's cleidocranial diastosis, the anterior, okay, sorry, I think I, I was just like doing some typing error. It's just one, the anterior, so. The anterior fontanel never closes to form bregma, okay? The anterior fontanel never closes to form bregma, all right? So this is the bregma, all right? That's the meeting point of, of the sagittal uh, suture. And the coronal suture, all right. Now, the meeting point of the sagittal suture and the lambda uh, uh, suture is what we call the lambda. Now, what is the clinical importance of the bregma? All right, I would just like you as medics to just um just visualize this in your head because I don't know. There are many pictures on this online, but I I, I was just like I don't know. I just keep. I wasn't able to get a picture for you guys. Now, let's see. In a very tense and bulging anterior fontanel in the neonates, this in indicates intracranial pressure. Now, in a sunken or depressed fontanel in an infant, it would be an indication of dehydration, okay? You know that the anterior fontanel is somehow open. Uh, so if you have so, so much intracranial pressure, it will actually bulge out, okay? Uh, if you have uh, dehydration, Okay, it will actually go in. This is the clinical importance of Bregma that we are talking about. And now, next, we say that the Bregma that's in adults, it is often used as a reference point for stereotactic surgery of the brain. Okay, stereotactic surgery of the brain. Right? But this, we are done with our tutorial. Was this tutorial? Yeah, this is tutorial. But this is like trying to ask us some questions briefly, okay? Because uh, for most students who can't really... Most students, they comprehend better when they listing, okay? So I just made this personally for myself, oh, because uh, I comprehend better when I listing, okay? All right, so... And I didn't have anybody who was up to do this for me, so I'm just doing it for myself. And many other people will benefit. All right. So see you guys in the next tutorial. And we are done with our 20th question on head and head uh, of.
of head and neck anatomy okay so we'll proceed we have 150 questions to to cover and we'll relent we celebrate but we go on to celebrate more